days later, the Queen Mother arrives at London Airport for the start of her journey to the Young Federation of Rhodesia in Nyasaland. Princess Margaret, Prince Charles and Princess Anne are here to see her off. Prince Charles manages to hold up the departure for several minutes so that he and his sister can have a good look at the Britannia airliner. But eventually the goodbyes are said. The Queen Mother takes her leave of the official party and the royal children are left in their aunt's charge. The whole journey is scheduled to take 19 hours and the first stop is Carlo, nearly 3,000 miles away. The Queen Mother's cheerful energy as she takes her full share of royal duties makes us forget that many grandmothers in their late 50s would be starting to take things easily. But that is not the way of the Queen Mother, Britain's most tireless roving ambassador. 